Hi, welcome to day two of how to help those who are hurting. Um, today we're going to talk about when you find out that somebody has had a loss of a child, a loss of a spouse, a uh, divorce, uh, some kind of illness. It's often a very uncomfortable time for us as humans. Um, we don't know how to respond emotionally and we want to help and we want to jump in and fix things, but that's not the best solution. So sometimes we resort to um, doing nothing and not even acknowledging it because the feelings are so uncomfortable for us. And I would just say um, a way to help and support those that are hurting is to acknowledge that, that you see them that you know that they're going through something difficult and that you're there for them. Um, offering, just saying you're sorry and, and sitting with them and listening to them without offering up any advice, any tips or anything like that. Um, oftentimes people get offended um, when, when a death has gone by and nobody's even acknowledged it. Um, that is part of, of us feeling uncomfortable. And I can remember when my husband's um, father died, we remember every person who showed up, called or sent a card. You know, you remember those who show up when you need them. So be that person, be that person that shows up. Even if you don't know what to say, you don't need to say anything, you just need to show up. And, and show them that you love them and that you care. This is day two of how to help those who are hurting. And I'm gonna be giving tips for the next few days. Doreen Steenland from Living Full Life Coaching. Have a great day.